queen. Uh, yeah, so they're going into business together. Well, we have, a, we have a little clip. It's a sneak preview from Monday's episode where I think we can see Maz and Ian Bill getting along just fine. A china? Mm. That's all salt? Mm. Christian, what do you want? Salt? Sure. Uh, 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 what are you doing? You are joking. The rules are there for a reason. OK. Didn't cross the line, did I? Oh, no. What are you doing? Get in with the rhythm. Don't you know music can increase productivity? <laughs> Do you think Jamie jiggles while he's cooking? Do you think Delia does a belly dance while she's doing her dumplings? No. This is a serious business, thank you. Not the set of a Bollywood film. <laughs> You obviously love your comedy. Uh, yeah, no, well, you know, there's a, there's a lot of tragedy on that show as well. well so yeah, there uh, is, but I'm kind of rather hoping that you're going to sort of brighten it up a bit. Uh, well, yeah, I think, I, you know, we've had such a good response to the Masoods, and people do stop you in the street and go, you know, it gets a bit heavy, that show, and it's nice to have a bit of comedy on it. But um, I think it keeps you, keeps you busy, you know, playing it slightly. I, I, th I, think, I think the intention was to play it light at the beginning, which allows you to go somewhere with it. Because it must be very, I mean, it must be quite a scary premise to actually just walk into an established soap when you're in, uh, sort of as a family. Because I know I, when you think of that, the Ferreras and how badly that that's went, right. that must the, hang over everybody. I know, the track record but it wasn't great, was it, with the Ferreras? Um, yeah, I think there was a lot of, there was a, there was a pretty big magnifying glass with the Masoods. And, of course, they're, Mus they're Muslim, yeah. they're Pakistani Muslim. So there's a lot of uh, pressure to get it right. But I think with the fact that Nina and I know each other and we'd kind of made a conscious decision to play a little bit more comedy with it rather than get too heavy too soon with, with the storylines. It's, it's kind of paid off, you know. Good, I do, yeah. good. Because I, I know, you know Sanjeev, don't you, Sanjeev? I, I'm very good friends with Sanjeev, yeah. And, and you, you, you worked on a show, because this ties up with a, with a great birth story, which we've been doing quite a few this week. So, so you were out in Mumbai. That's right. Sanjeev and, I got, uh, Sanjeev and I did a pilot for a comedy called Mumbai Calling for ITV. And, and uh, so, uh, actually, soon after I got approached by EastEnders, I got a phone call saying that's been commissioned as well. So I managed to do... <laughs> yeah, <laughs> thank you. It's unheard of. Two jobs, two jobs in a year. Um, and so Sanj and I went off to India for three months to do this, and, uh, to, the, to do this sitcom, and um, I got asked to write an episode. So, of course, there was a lot of pressure on me to write the first time I'd written. And uh, it was a week before the episode was being shot, I'd said to my wife, listen, look, please try not to have the baby this week. And at this point, she's, like, <laughs> really imminent. Yeah, yeah. I mean, the baby's due in two weeks, and I'm going, not this week. Please don't. It's my episode this week. Um, <laughs> and, uh, and you can do it the week after. Just cross your legs and... Um, <laughs> and, of course, yeah, well, the, the morning of the first scene of my episode, uh, what I wrote, I get, uh, there, was a, there was one guy who basically was being paid to hold my phone. And that's it. That's all he had to do, is look after my face. If it rings, you tell me now. It, w it doesn't matter where, whether we're in a take or not. But in, so, anyway, first scene, he goes, there's a, uh, Mr. Nitin, there's a phone ringing. <laughs> okay. So, OK, thank you very much. And pho she's, she's in labour. Sanjeev and the producer are standing and going, well, I don't think you'll get there in time. I'm, uh. You're in Mumbai. Yeah. She's back at home. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And... Uh, and so I go, I went, OK, fine, look, they could see on my face, I'm not sticking around. It was the one day I didn't bring my passport to the set. So tr if anyone's seen Mumbai traffic, yeah. it's, you know, I... So one, the, the producer went to the airport, I went to the hotel, 45 minutes each way, he went and bought me a ticket, I went that way, met him at the airport, and got on a flight, which was about to leave. Did you make it? Eight, nine-hour journey. I had no fingernails left. I'm sitting there going, oh, my God. The plane circled three times. There was a queue. <laughs> it was supposed to land at 6. It circled three times. We landed at quarter to 7. 
jumped in the... Oh, yeah, then, of course, I'm trying to get through immigration. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Welcome and I've Britain. got that face that says, excuse me, sir, could you step into this room, please? <laughs> uh, yeah, the, and, you know, they're slapping, <laughs> they're slapping... I've got that face. <laughs> <laughs> I've got that face. <laughs> in fact, it's happened so often, I can't look forward to it now. Yeah. Um, you know, I've often been in these rooms where I, I hear the squidge of this gel <laughs> on the okay, palm. Okay. OK, enjoy your breakfast. Did you, uh, did you get there? Did you... Get I I got there, I screamed, you know, I had just had a backpack, so there's a brown guy with a beard <laughs> running through Heathrow. Yeah. Yeah. I had my backpack, brown guy, beard, running, screaming through Heathrow Airport, and this guy's going, the queue's over there. And I'm going, no, look. And I'm screaming, I'm the Asian guy off EastEnders! <laughs> I'm having a baby! Jump, get through. I think they were just too scared. They just let me through, got in the car. I got there 30, no, 28 minutes late. 28 oh. minutes late. That's oh. okay. That's all right. Yeah. I just had airplane food. You know, I was I, I was still digesting by the time I got to the air, uh, hospital. Uh, there we have. But she did hold on as long as there. Yeah. Oh. The, the, oh, that was me oh, yeah. having just arrived. Yeah. And and the missus she was she happy with you being 28 minutes late? I mean, it's a supreme effort. I have to say. It was. It was, well. It was the running and on the phone. You yeah, know, yeah. of course. That's the hysterical bit. Running through Heathrow. But airport. did she understand? Because women, if Larry, did. forgive me, they famously don't, do they? Well, you know, this, this is our second son. The first time round, I was there throughout the whole thing, throughout the whole night. Well, the second and third, it doesn't really matter, does it? Well, the first time round, she she hit me a lot. She hit me, and she's not that sort of person. She <laughs> I did beat me. you, Matthew. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Listen, we better tell the guys at home what's happening on the show today, but it's great to have you here. Yeah. <laughs>